Shoot him. I got wow. the snow goose. <laughs> you did? Yeah. I went sp I went right you went. Bam bam baby! Some damn good shooting. Yeah, buddy. Yo, 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 yo! What's up guys? Welcome back to another one. I hope you guys are really enjoying this little mini series that I am providing to you guys. I think I started this Thursday. I'm gonna go through Sunday. If you guys want me to do more of these, more of this mini series. Uh, about laws, regulations, tips, uh, limits, you know, ammo, being lead, steel, all that stuff, drop a comment down below, smash the like button on this video so I know that I need to keep doing these guys if they are that helpful to you. So today guys, we're going to cover teal limits and we're going to cover, you know, what type of fines and penalties you could receive for shooting over your limit of teal. Also, I'm going to drop a little bit of advice on y'all's butts about another little fast flying darting duck that looks like a teal and that you absolutely cannot shoot in this early teal season. But honestly guys, like always, I, got, I want you to drop a comment down below and give me your personal stories, you know, your dumbass brother or cousin or friend that shot over their limit and I want to know what type of fines they got. Was it per bird? You know, what state was it from? So I always like hearing you guys' stories, so drop it down below and let us all know. My biggest piece of advice for this deal. Daily bag limit of till here in Kansas. Don't worry, I just looked it up. So go check it out for yourself in your own states but here in Kansas it is six teal now that's a daily bag limit that's what you can go out and shoot on on a day-to-day -day basis now what you can't do and what you have to remember is possession limit is 18 teal so that means the ones you shot today the ones you shot yesterday and the ones that you have in your freezer however many that is cannot be any more than 18 birds. The possession limit is something you really have to remember guys. That, that, is, that is very, very crucial. So like usual, I got online and I got on some forums, some waterfowl forums, hunting forums, duck hunting, goose hunting, that whole jazz. And I found this guy right here. This, this isn't particularly about tills in general, but you guys will laugh. Little paper here. This guy states, <laughs> when I got caught for hunting over corn out of season, the fine was only $3,800. It, it was only $3,800, guys. I mean, <laughs> and I got to keep my license. So he, he he's just excited he got to keep his license. J guys, don't be this guy right here. Uh, hunting out of season. Oh man. <laughs> now I know, I know you guys are not <laughs> stupid like this guy. I understand that. But like I said before, I do these videos just as a reminder to get these possession limits, to get this, you know, the, the lead and steel, to get all this, this, these laws and information back in your head before you guys go hit these marshes and all these public hunting spots where, in fact, you will probably be checked. But going back to what we were originally talking about, shooting over your limit of teal. So I read around on these forums and I think the consensus of what I came up with was it, it really varies, you know, the defined fine, the charge per state to state. Like I said, if you guys have any information on your state of what you get fined for shooting over the limit of teal, drop it down below. A common consensus was about $250 per bird that they were over their limit on. So that's possession limit, that's bag limit, doesn't matter. Uh, $250 per teal that they were over on. Now I did read some states that were a little stricter and I don't blame them for being strict because it is the law guys, that they were charged four to $500 per bird. Boys, that is stiff. I think I think my second really uh, good piece of advice here, it, other than being limits, uh, you know, know your species before you shoot in the mornings. It's gonna be it's gonna be damn near dark when teal fly. So they're so small, 
sometimes very hard to identify, and I will give you guys one little hint. Juvenile wood ducks. If you have you know any type of population of wood duck wood, wood ducks in your area, like a lot of you guys down south, those bad boys resemble teal almost to the T when it is low light conditions out early, early in the AM. Be careful what you're shooting. My best advice to you guys is if you accidentally shoot a, a species that is out of season during this till season, like a wood duck or something, and you get checked, do not try to hide it. It was obviously an accident. When you do these things, I know all you guys are just like me. You wouldn't intentionally shoot a bird out of season. So just be honest if you get checked by a game warden. Show them, look, this was a clear mistake. I shot this one. I didn't mean to. It was damn near dark out. I am extremely sorry. The more upfront you can be with a game warden, the more he's going to respect you and the nicer he's going to be. So, great tip, guys. But, guys... I beg and plead you, whatever state that you live in, read all your seasons, your dates, your low plains, high plains, what what region you're in as far as timeline for the hunting year. Know your limits. Know, know all that you can. Print it off. Put it in your glove compartment so you'll have it handy right off you know, you know the, the, the website. Do whatever it takes to get your guys' knowledge up so you don't get in trouble. I'm not saying you're stupid, I just want to help. Oh, but guys, if you guys have any good information, drop it down below. And if you have not, follow me on Instagram, right chia. But if you are a true foul addict, you will go and subscribe right now and hit that notification button so you're notified when I upload this whole coming season because it is fitting to be lit. But I want to thank you guys for watching yet again. I will see you on the next one. Another one will be coming out tomorrow. Have a good one. Have a great weekend. We'll see you guys. Peace. Guala, 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 guala. She said her name, but I forgot it. I seen it like this, so I copped it. If you ain't talking money, change the topic.